Hello everyone, good morning. I'm back in Akaponobashi, which is a district close to Shinjuku, and I'm on my way to the renovated Rocky Shinjuku branch. Oh, can't forget about this staircase right here. So many steps. Alright everyone, welcome to the revamped Rocky Shinjuku branch. Entrance is fancy, and you got the classic logo as well. But before I go in, I want to get a drink, so I want to go Family Mart. Right, I'm just going to get my usual drink as well. Good drink. So this is the entrance area. The locker areas remain the same. Only difference is that whereas this used to be where there were chairs and benches for you to be able to take a rest and eat, it's all changed to a lounge area and I think they're gonna install a TV in there just for events and whatnot. But it looks pretty nice, we'll check it out later. So I'm just taking a small break, but this is the break room. There's a window so you can see who's climbing. TV will be installed here, a few sofas, and also there's a hot water tap and a microwave. So if you bought like a bento from the konbini, then you can just heat it up here, or if you brought lunch with you, which is in my case I did. So I'm just gonna take a quick lunch break and eat, and then I'll go back to climbing. As always, grades remain the same amongst all the rocky branches. 9Q all the way to 4th Dan. Some small valuables lockers. This actually moved from there, where the satellite board is, same angle like every branch and the hangboard set up there, to here. So feel free to grab a key if you've got small belongings. And also free Wi-Fi. There is some slab. <laughs> and some overhang as well. Now this is something special everyone. This is Tokyo's second ever Burden of Dreams replica. Now Sean Bailey was actually here last week trying it out as well. And a few Japanese climbers are actually in Finland right now trying it out. I think Ryuichi Murai, when I talked to him, I said he would be the most likely to send it out of all the Japanese climbers and he agreed I think. <laughs> they got rid of some of the benches in favour of this kind of seating area. It kind of reminds me of the arch building one. Just a overhang from a different angle. And some places to put your phones and belongings. And the main attraction, the monster wall, large overhang. And then to the side of the monster wall, there is some more slab. 